Hey guys, I'm gonna make a shrimp pasta and this is my signature dish. It is honestly, hands down, one of the best dishes I've made. If you want to make somebody fall in love with you, make them this dish. Everybody likes it. Unless they don't like shrimp or they have a nut allergy or they can't eat gluten. Yeah, that's pretty much it. I already prepared everything, so let's go. shrimp water I actually slightly overcooked them because I wasn't careful I didn't really watch them and then we have Trader Joe's pistachios If you intend on making this, be very careful. Just cook everything on low heat and I think you'll be safe. The cool thing about this dish is you can really switch up the ingredients. Like you can try it with mushrooms, you can try it with zucchini, but I would really recommend to add cherry tomatoes. The cherry tomatoes and the pistachios really make a big difference. The other ingredients can easily be switched up. Good morning! Well, I'm gonna head to the gym now and then I'll get groceries after and cook something and that's gonna be the plan for today pretty much. So let's go! Okay, we can't forget to pack the Aldi bag because I'm an Aldi girl through and through and if you're wondering why I don't have any lights here it's because my lamp doesn't work anymore. I don't know why but I can switch it on and off and it doesn't work and also the light in the basement doesn't switch on anymore. That's honestly great. I'm honestly grateful that it just rained because that way not many people come out and today is a day where I just can't stand being surrounded by people I usually prefer to be alone I'm back from the gym and the grocery store and it is still raining so because it's raining I'm really craving something warm and I saw a video the other day from this huge youtuber she had this hand pulled noodle soup and I was like oh my god I want to create something similar okay, I want to show you the video that inspired me to make this dish
I looked the recipe up and I realized I don't have the ingredients for it, but what I have, I have this. I'm just gonna use the powder of this to make the soup base and then I'm gonna do the same hand pulling, dough no noodle pulling, the hand, the dough pulling, the noodle pulling. I know if I make the broth myself, it's not gonna taste as good, so I'm just gonna use this. Oh no. If you know me, you know that I absolutely hate touching sticky stuff like this. That doesn't make sense, I know. So the takeaway I have from this video is that the dough should be sticky and it should be stretchy. And I feel like this is not stretchy enough. this dish in my videos make sure to never film myself because I look so tragic my nose is running my eyes are tearing up my mouth is burning I just I can't slurp you know when I posted my breakup video this is more painful than what I was going through back then I gotta say though, some of these are a bit too salty, like, ugh. Hey guys and welcome back. I just finished grocery shopping and it got changed because it's really really hot outside. I'm gonna make an acai bowl. I have two of these and I'm gonna make one now as like a snack. I'm actually really hungry so let's make this. <laughs>
Good morning, guys. Um, I'm gonna make a matcha latte and then I'll head to work. And that's gonna be my day. Let's go.